was at him. Anybody that know me know that I've been a LeBron James fan since 2002, 2001, when he was in high school. Dude is amazing. Enjoyed his career. And uh, appreciate the entertainment value that it's brought, that I've enjoyed over these years. Now, with that being said, I got some questions. This dude is 33 years old. He's been in the league 15 years. At some point, no matter how athletic you are, how athletically gifted you are, your body starts to, to age. You know, things start to happen. This man just took off from the dotted line, presumably at the speed of light. And dunked on these boys. <laughs> With the help of the lane, can't get it. Here comes the ball. And the lane parted it. Y'all mean to tell me he just did that and he had no help? I don't know what kind of help he got. Obviously, it's a scientific miracle. Also, in his 15th season, he all of a sudden developed a jump shot. He got a step back three. Step back three ain't been there his whole career. He just got that. And y'all gonna tell me this normal right here. Porzingis like smiling at him. Six to shoot. James steps in at three for another one. Oh, knocks it down. LeBron James from downtown. The Who you know developing a jump shot in their 15th season as an NBA player? Huh? He couldn't shoot a lick his whole career. All of a sudden, he just pulling up. Nah, I ain't going. How you got a full head of hair with a fade? I can't have no fade. I ain't <laughs> had no hair in, in 17 years. Well, seven years, but it's the same. I would give any. Really, I just want to know how you grow your hairline back, LeBron. That's all I really want to know. Somebody <laughs> share this with LeBron. Basically, I come to my conclusion that technology has allowed man. Mm hmm. To create a synthetic human, this dude gotta be a robot. And that's all I got to say about it. He gotta be a robot. He got a hell.